Anitha Nanathom and Topia Sopsin Tavitsanen have joined the T1 Dota 2 team ahead of the qualifiers for the International 11. T1 has been on the lookout for a new mid and carry player after releasing Carl Carl Baldovino and Kim Gabby Santos earlier this month. Despite solid performances throughout the year T1 failed to establish themselves as the top C team, and were looking to make a big change ahead of the international. The two new players will join the team for the International 11 C qualifier, which is due to start on 3rd of September, and features the top teams from the C region that did not qualify for the international through Dota Pro Circuit points. Fortunately for T1, Fantic will not be in the qualifier after a last-minute rule clarification granted them a spot at the competition. Both of T1's new players are former two-time T winners, having taken impressive victories at both the International 8 and 9 as part of OG. Both players were relatively unknown before joining OG, and surprised the world when they won T8 after being major underdogs heading into the competition. Now both are considered legends of the Dota scene, and were some of the hottest free agents available. Following the 2021 season both players took a break from professional play, with NS standing in for a couple of teams at LAN events this season. Topson was still contracted to OG, but a few weeks ago was released and allowed to search for a new team as he wanted to play in the T qualifiers. Both players now have their new home, but if they fail to qualify for T it is likely they won't stick around for next season. Despite both Boom and Fantic qualifying to T via points, the C qualifier is still incredibly stacked. Talon will be the favorites, with the likes of RSG and SMG also being touted as potential teams to qualify. With only one spot in the main event it is going to be a difficult task for a newly formed team to take it, but with two last chance qualifier spots available most fancy team want to at least take one of those. Not only will the new T1 lineup need to learn how to play with their two new superstars in a short space of time, they will also have to figure out a new patch, as Valve has announced that Dota 2 Patch 7.32 will launch before the qualifiers for the international start.